So over here, you can see that I have a frame right here. So if I were to go around right here and then select out shapes right here, then you can see that I can freely draw this out. But what happens is that to exactly place them out in equal spacing, it is quite hard. And to manage out the spacing, you can uh, what you can do is you can enable out the layout grid. And to do that, you can go around over here onto the frame. And if you were to go around over here onto the layout grid, you can click here and you can see that the layout grid is enabled right here. So if I were to go around onto the grid option right here, you can go around and increase this in size, um, like have a difference of the pixel size on the grid right here. So let's say, for example, I set this to 50 and now everything is 50 pixels apart. As you can see, you can go around over here, change out the uh, color of the grid as well. And this is what you have. So now if you want to place out these objects, you can go around and place this within the grid right here. Let's say, for example, here you can place this out in the exact um, three by three grid right here. And if you were to go around right here, just like this, you can go around right here and then uh, place it on three by three grid. And if I were to click and hold all, you can see that because of the grid, I exactly know where to place them right here. And similarly, you can go around right here, place this out over here exactly. And you can see that you have exact spacing right here and you know uh, exactly how much of a grid you want. So this is what you can do with the grid. You can work around with the placement. You can go around right here, hold alt, click and drag. And then this is what you have, as you can see right here. You can also go around over here, click alt and drag it. And let's say I want two box spacing right here. And this is what I have. And that is how you can work around with layout grid inside of uh, a design file in Figma. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.